in Laser Research Center, we are operating uh, uh, laser which produces uh, sub 10 femtosecond pulses with peak power around one terawatt. It is the highest peak power laser in Baltic states. These lasers are matured by Lithuanian laser companies and uh, uh, these systems are installed and are used as a workhorse in the extreme light infrastructure at Szeged, Hungary. Here in Vilnius University we are co continuing to explore the possibilities to operate these lasers in infrared and XUV speckled ranges, we can, we can expect even shorter autosecond pulses. Here in Vilnius University, we are working in biophotonics laboratory and we are using nonlinear microscope. It has several advantages in compare with conventional bright field uh, microscopy. Uh, staining is not necessary for nonlinear microscope. You can also uh, go deeper into the tissue and uh, perform optical sections and also make three dimensional images. Collagen is the main protein of the human body and it's well known that uh, its structure changes uh, in pathology. Nonlinear microscopy is able to investigate those structures so that's why uh, it's beneficial in medicine and especially in cancer diagnostics. Light is the purest form of energy. And just by looking at powerful laser, you can understand what that energy is capable to do. Laser drilling, welding are traditional laser machining techniques that work on a simple premise. If material can absorb light, and you have a powerful light source, and you are good to go. But what happens when you have a transparent material that cannot absorb light, then you're in trouble. Fortunately, recent advances in femtosecond laser machining changed the trend. The concept of transparent material doesn't exist for ultra-fast laser. This feature makes ultra-fast laser machining very unique. You can form precise cuts, drill micro-holes or modify material in any way you want, change the optical properties or change the surface structure of the glass material and produce various photonics applications and also some micro-mechanical devices. At Vilnius University Laser Research Center uh, we study and develop laser micro-machining techniques and people believe that 21st century will be the century of photon, meaning the century of light. And we work in order to achieve this goal.